Uh, so good morning, folks. In fact, what I'm going to do is turn the camera off because nobody wants to see my ugly mug. Let's face it. Um, and I am. I think you should take a vote on that. Nobody wants to see that, especially this early in the morning. Come on. <laughs> 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 but also the uh joking aside the the uh, video broke up a bit on yours mr b so i know it on zoom okay. struggles sometimes so let's kill that uh and concentrate on the screen so uh yes folks i wanted to share with you this new software tool which uh i got made aware of about a week ago so breaking news and i know many of you might have tried things like click funnels uh and generally what we find with this business that we're in is you end up with what we call a technology stack in that you've got Lots of different tools. Uh, you've got click funnels, which is really good at making sales funnels stuff. You might have a page builder. You might be using something like lead pages. You've got another tool for your email list and managing your email list. You've got another tool for delivering online courses, um, something like Kajabi, perhaps, which is what we use at Internet Business School. So there is a whole set of tools that we are using in um, in internet marketing. And uh, someone took me off about this tool and said, this thing's actually really quite good. I've not heard of it before, but it seems to do everything in one place and it seems to work. And some of you might know, uh, there was a tool last year that came out, which was GrooveFunnels, which we um, started using. And it had a, a fantastic delivery schedule for all the bells and whistles they were going to be adding. Um, but if any of you have been kind of keeping up with that, they've not quite hit the deadlines um, with where they were expecting to be. And some of the functionality is not quite worked as smoothly as we would have liked. So I'm always on the lookout for new um, new tools and technologies and things that we can do. Um, so let me introduce you to this new tool. Now, the best thing about this new tool of all, firstly, is it's dirt cheap, but even better than dirt cheap, it's actually free until you start making money. I mean, how good is that? So this tool lets you build your first membership site for free. It lets you have your first thousand customers in a database before you've got to pay for it um so it is pretty damn impressive so i would urge you firstly just to go to the page and fill in your email address because that will lock you in for the free access i don't know how long this is going to be available but i'll put this link in the chat box as well let me just do that literally it doesn't ask for card or anything it's just pop your email address in so actually do that now because that'll be useful then as I'm going through some other bits, you'll be able to kind of follow um, where I'm going in the system. I want to show you some of the things it does uh, and actually show you how I've made the uh, best part of a thousand quid using it in the last 24 hours. And I haven't paid for the software yet. So just to really reinforce that the free version really does work. You really can make money because often some of these software tools, you know, they give you the free version and then you find out that, some of the key functionality that you realistically need to make money actually you've got to pay for this genuinely you can make money using the free version i haven't paid a penny for it yet and i'll show you in a second if i log into my account and i'll show you um what we've done so i just wanted to show you like a few of the features but i said what it's doing is it's a funnel builder it's actually a website builder as well you can build landing pages and a complete website in it um you can do membership sites in it you can do online courses you can do emails, you can even do evergreen webinars, and you can even run your own affiliate system through there as well. So you can actually administer your own um, affiliates through the system. So you can actually have other people selling your stuff and uh, working out, uh, yeah, it works out all the commissions for them, etc. So really, really uh, cool, cool stuff. So uh, go to that link now and just put your email address in that's it then come back here uh, and i will show you what it looks like on the inside okay let me just put that link in there again for anyone that missed it the first time cool so let's just have a look i've got a few screenshots here um obviously i've got to be a little bit sensitive of because uh, we've got real data in there for some real customers so some of the older bits i can't show you live live uh but i'm going to show you how we built a course in there, how we built a web page in there in a second. But let's firstly look at what the functionality does. So as I said, it's sales funnels, it's email marketing, it's a website builder, it's affiliate management, it's business automation, it's evergreen webinars, it's online courses, it's blogging, and it's selling, you can sell physical products or digital products. So basically, it replaces a whole stack of stuff. It replaces the need for a stack of systems like ClickFunnels, which we currently got. We're paying a couple of hundred dollars a month for that. Kajabi, we're paying a few thousand dollars a year for Kajabi. MailChimp, I think we're in, obviously we're not the entry level for 
uh, MailChimp. So I think we're like a hundred bucks a month for that. Samcart, we use that as our kind of checkout shopping cart. Uh, that's about a hundred a month for that one. Lead pages, I think that's about a hundred a month. We've got Kartra, which is a bit of an overlap with some of the other systems. It's an alternative to some of the others. So you don't need that as well. But realistically, this software tool replaces five, six, seven other tools that you might use in your internet business. And the pricing is kind of crazy cheap. Look at this. So for the free version, which you've got the link on screen there, so you've got it in the chat, you get your first thousand contacts or customers, you get three sales funnels, you get a blog, you get your first membership site, you get unlimited storage space, you get unlimited membership membership site members. You can do, you can start using the automation and workflow stuff. You can have an email campaign. You can have a one-click upsell. You can have an order bump. You can do A-B split testing. You can do coupons. You can integrate it with your payment processors. So basically, if you look at that leftmost column, you can do everything you need to launch your first product and make money online, okay? Which I think is pretty amazing. I haven't seen any other software stack that really lets you have that much functionality genuinely for free. And then if you look at the pricing as it goes up, the next rung up, if you want to launch your second course or your third course or your second, third, fourth product, it's only 27 US dollars a month, even at that level. And that keeps you going for 10 sales funnels for five different membership sites. Um, and even the, the Rolls Royce with his like unlimited everything is only $97 a month. And that's the price you'd pay for one of those other tools. In fact, it's less than uh click funnels is per month it's less than kajabi is a month so pretty keen pricing okay so let's look at a few things that you can do so you can build courses in there okay it's the first thing in fact um i'm going to show you some some slides here and then i'm going to just jump in and show you some practical stuff so what we did to test this out and literally we did this on thursday for something we launched yesterday if you're on our list you would have seen this yesterday because i knew i kind of thought this was breaking news and i wanted to share this with everybody because i just thought this is a great tool um, so I like doing things really, really quickly. Uh, and that's, you know, how I got started when I got started, literally I'd read a, an idea in a newspaper in the morning and I'd have a, uh, a, a, a website launched by that evening, literally as quick as that. And this system lets you do that because, you know, I, I had the idea on Thursday. Okay. Let's, let's put a course onto this platform and let's launch it on Friday so I can talk about it on Saturday. So that's exactly what we did. We, um, had a course which we just recently created so we had the content of the course already created obviously we didn't record all the videos for this course from scratch we had them already but obviously if you're creating your own course you could create your own course and this is definitely showing you how you could launch your course and start making money in 24 hours but also if you were selling a resale rights course of course you've got the course content already in that model as well so it's a real simple course builder i'm going to show you that in a second but it's just a screenshot of the course building part where you can basically add different modules to the course um, and add videos for different modules of the course so you can build the course within that area really simply um, this is what the uh, the kind of course modules look like so you can embed videos and it's got a really good page builder so you can do multi-column layouts and all the usual stuff you'd expect with any sort of WYSIWYG tool for developing content so it's much like using um, like a word processor if you like but with extras for embedding videos and audios and that kind of stuff so it's pretty cool um, it also when you start selling it. So I took a screenshot last night. We launched this course yesterday and um, we'd signed up 25 students on this new course by then. Um, we'd actually um, got more by this morning. I'll log in and show you some real stats in a second as well. Um, so it shows you the progress so you can see how your students are progressing. Obviously I took this when they just bought the product. So only one of them had actually made any meaningful progress. So if you're on here today, Ian, well done. You're the leader because you'd already got, already got through the first couple of modules of the course when I took this snag yesterday evening. It also has automation. Now this is really cool because this is the sort of stuff that you don't get actually in many of those other higher ticket tools. And what the automation does is it lets you trigger um, actions to specific uh, events so basically an event could be if somebody signs up for a course you can firstly you could tag them it's a quite a common thing to do to segment your database so if somebody 
takes a specific action. It could be they've downloaded your free ebook. It could be they've signed up for a course. It could be they've bought this product. It's a good habit to always tag them. And what that does is it, it just segments your database and it just puts a little marker on them and says, okay, this is a sub list of all the people that bought this product. This is a sub list of all the people in your database that went to this webinar. This is a sub list of all the people that are interested in Facebook marketing, et cetera. So you can do things like applying tags, but you can also do automation as well. So you can fire off emails to people. Um, so you could, you know, do follow up emails. And you can also do follow-up marketing. So you can say, if somebody's bought product A, it'd be a really good idea to send them an email about product B or product C, because these are the, the logical sequence of products that would next apply to those people. So it's got all this automation stuff in there, which is really cool. It's got payment integration to the two major payment gateways, which are Stripe and PayPal. And it was really easy to, uh, to connect to Stripe. Now, I already had a Stripe account to connect it to, but if you haven't got one, you just hit Stripe within System E, and it just takes you through the process of actually signing up for a new Stripe account. So it makes that really, really easy. So literally, it took me like five minutes to get a payment gateway set up with it. And you can build web page. So I just knocked up a real quick page to sell this course. So we launched this social media made simple course on this platform yesterday. You probably got an email about it. Um, I'll show you the page builder in a second. Now, yeah, I didn't really spend much time on this. It was my first attempt, but it kind of looks functional, right? It would definitely get you out of the blocks launching your first course. And if you've attended one of my courses, you know, one of my big um, quotes, my big sort of maxims that I, that I talk about is ready, fire, aim. And that is like, have an idea, get it out there, then tweak it and refine it and polish it and make it more beautiful once you know it works and once you know it's making money. But straight out of the blocks just get something out there and that's what we're going to do with this yesterday i just wanted to get something out there and one thing i'll say about this product is at no point yesterday when i was building this did i look at a manual it's that intuitive that just pressing things and doing what felt right i managed to build a course build a payment page link the two things together have a follow-up email and get it all working without resorting to any sort of tutorial. So in terms of speed to action as well, that's really good as well, because some software tools, and I'm thinking particularly here of things like ClickFunnels and also Infusionsoft, if you ever use that, it's not very intuitive. You don't know what button you're supposed to press. You do one thing and then you want to link something to something else and it doesn't work and you don't know what to do and you log a support ticket and you wait a week and you get uh, an answer several weeks later yeah confusion soft someone just said so um absolutely that is um very very common the problem that people have okay so let's just move on a little bit more now it also gives you a really nice dashboard so you can see when i snagged this last night we'd already got 31 sales we made 482 pounds from our little beta test uh, i'll log in a second and show you uh, what it looks like now but it has gone up I can, uh, I can, pleased to confirm. Uh, so I just wanted to show that real world. You know, this is literally live stuff, new product, uh, making money in a day. Uh, so you've hopefully you followed the link and you've gone and just popped your email address in there so you can follow uh, this through. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to pause sharing my screen for a second. I'm going to jump out into the tool and just show you live some of the features that I was just actually talking about okay so let me just start now i have to just do something a little bit creative here with my screen okay bear with me i'll be back to you in a second i just want to uh just show you this without showing you everything as I can't show any customer data. Let's go in here. Let's show you the course building a bit first. Okay, so hopefully you've got my screen back again. So this is what the system looks like. You've got um, dashboard here that shows you the total sales figures. Uh, you can see your all your contacts in here. You can see your funnels in here. Um, your courses, you build, unsurprisingly, under the products and sales menu under courses. And... Within here, you can build a course. So let's just have a look at this course here. And it's really intuitive. If you want to see what a module 
looks like just to test it you just press on the little preview page and it shows you what that module actually looks like in the real world kind of quite intuitive is what you'd expect to press if you want to edit something again you just press on the edit lecture settings and that takes you into the edit settings there kind of cool and if you want to edit the actual content you come into this and this is where the content is built so you've got this really nice editor here which lets you add videos so this is a this is a module in a course so you can add a video uh to the course just by choose literally choose okay i want to put a video where do you want to put it down there somewhere okay fine so it's added a video and then what you do is you can then go into the video and you could link it to a youtube video or if you've got your video uh, on a platform like Vimeo, you could put your embed code from Vimeo or any other platform, or you can actually just upload the video file straight into the System E platform. So you, it will host all your videos for you for free as well. Pretty cool. Okay, um, let's look at some of the things. So what I like about this editor, now it's like I didn't use any instructions or anything. I was literally just uh, playing with it. But what I really liked is this sort of stuff. So if I wanted a bit more space between these two videos, for example, you've got this margin stuff here. So you can just look at that, like just scroll it and it'll just give you a little bit of space between um, that and the, the previous thing. And it's just the, the layout of it is, is really nice. If you want to get rid of this, you just click on it and you've got a little trash can thing there. You go, actually, no, I don't want to put that video there. Change my mind and it will just get rid of it for you like so okay so really really simple to use editor really liked it if you wanted to put a bit of like a bullet point checklist just click on bullet point checklist and there's your bullet points there you can just merrily add stuff on there like so again if you want a bigger font size you've got these little sliders look and they're just changing it all in real time it's really cool uh you can change the spacing you can change the colors it's just really intuitive and I know, I know it kind of feels a bit strange, but what I liked about it was it just kind of works. You know, you just press stuff and it does exactly what you expect, which I know is what software is supposed to do, but in my experience, it often doesn't. So this is the the course builder part. When you're done up here, you just press that arrow there and say, uh, all I saved will be lost. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Uh, so I don't want to save it. There we go. So that's adding the course. Really, really simple. Uh, didn't take long to add the different modules and just embed the videos for that course that we'd already got created. Now, once you've got the course, the next thing that you need to do is you need to make the checkout page where you're going to sell the course from. So that's under the funnels section. So again, there's kind of two parts to it. There's the, the order page where someone's going to buy it from and there was a thank you page. So the order page is here. And what I did was um, I went into here and this is what the page actually looks like. So you can see it's fairly simple. I just use the same editor, the same editor that you use for the course modules. So I just put an image at the top of, of a graphic I'd had done on Fiverr for the course. Uh, it's an actually text, um, but things like the, the, um, the, the, box here for example you can change colors if you want to to you know if you want to that with a brighter red or pink or something you know it's just really really easy to do a couple of photos there um so just a really easy editor basically to um to build the page in now it's got a lot of templates as well so there are lots of different templates that you can um choose from there's like ready-made ones so actually let's just go back a step and let's make a new one just to show you um, what the things look like. So if I'm on funnels and I say I want to create a new funnel like so. And so you can do different kinds of um, funnels. You could do like opt-in ones, sometimes called squeeze pages, landing pages. You can do a sales page that's actually going to sell a product and have an order form on it. Uh, or you can do an evergreen webinar page as well. So you can make a page where you embed a video and then it has a buy now button um, 
that appears at the end so someone can buy from Evergreen Webinar. So let's just say we want to sell something. So I'm going to say create and I'm going to give this a name test two, like so. There we go. So this is all the different templates. So you've got all these nice different templates that you can use. And if you want to just preview one of these templates, I think this is the one that I used for my page yesterday. So you've got a, a nice little order page there, like a really nice looking template, all done. Uh, you could basically just cut and paste and change the text and the images to be your images. But they've got loads of nice templates in here. So really, really easy to set up your sales page. And you can also do um, automation rules. You can um, do split testing and you can do stats. In fact, we go back to the existing funnel. So let's just go back to the one that I've already made and used yesterday. So for example, look, you can see the live stats on this funnel that I made yesterday. So you can see I've actually sold 838 pounds from a little test. Um, as I keep saying, bear in mind, I haven't paid a penny for the software yet. So I've made almost a grand in 24 hours and I haven't actually paid for the software that I used to do it, which I think is pretty damn cool. Um, so we've had uh, 287 people came as far as the web page, and we've got 46 of those people have actually checked out. So 287 people viewed the page. It's a pretty good conversion rate, actually, 16% conversion rate. Um, and you can see it gives you metrics down to earnings per page view and stuff as well. Um, so let's just look at another couple of menus. So you've also got um, the uh, affiliate program. So you can have, uh, you can run your own affiliate program. You can invite other people to promote your course or your products and earn a commission. So that's all built in. Um, and all the financial stuff goes in here. So you can see the invoices. You can do all the refunds on Stripe, all from within the platform as well, which is really cool. You can create newsletters. So it's got a, a newsletter feature within here, and it's got newsletter templates. It's got a couple of different editors for making newsletters. So that's cool too. You can actually make a blog using this. I haven't done this yet, but there's a blog tool there. So you can actually create a blog and you can put all this on your own domain name as well. So you can use custom domains with the tool as well. Um, and all your customer data lands in here. So you can see your customers in the contact section. I won't click in that because that will start showing people's email addresses, which I don't want to share on a public webinar. Um, but you get the idea. Hopefully this gives you a little flavor. But as I said, it's really intuitive just playing around with it. I just found it really, really useful. So just wanted to kind of share that with you to uh, give you a little insight into it. And I know many of you are kind of looking at launching your first course. So some of you might have actually bought some of the um, some of that technology stack and not got around to using it. You know, often many people have signed up for ClickFunnels and six months later, they haven't actually launched their first product yet and they're still paying money every month. So um, this, I think, is brilliant for those of you that are starting out because this gives you everything you want and literally it doesn't cost you a penny uh, until you start making money, until you've outgrown the free plan, i.e., which is going to be you're doing your second course or you've got over a 1,000 um, contacts in your database, 1,000 customers. Um, so I think that's pretty damn cool and you know i've tried it i've used it we launched a course on it yesterday it's made 800 and something quid it all works um so um yeah i just wanted to share that with you um today really so if you've got any uh questions about that then uh please give me a little shout out uh I can say I see a few questions been coming in while I've been talking. So let me just go back a little bit and see. Uh, oh, we've got John said, is there a catch? No, that's the point. That's why I wanted to test it, John. I wanted to see if I could really launch uh, a product and collect some money. And I haven't, like I say, I, I keep pinching myself because I've never used a software tool that I've made money from that didn't actually cost me some money in the first place. But I really have made almost a grand in 24 hours. Well, less than 24 hours. We only launched this about 4 p.m. yesterday. So we've got another four hours to go. So it'll probably hit a grand in 24 hours um, without having spent a penny on the software, which is really, really cool. Uh, Juan, and the same question came from someone else is, how did you drive traffic? So I use my list. Uh, so obviously, I've got a database. So I mailed my existing list and said, hey, we've got a new course. Go and look at, look at it here. But 
bearing in mind you've got affiliate management with this as well, then even if you haven't got your own list, what you could do is build your course in the platform and then contact some JV partners. And as Ben was saying earlier, the standard for JVs is 50-50. So a JV partner with a list would expect 50% of the sales revenue and you would get 50% of the revenue as the course owner or the product owner. So even if you haven't got an existing list, all you've got to do is just approach some list owners and say, hey, I've got this product. It's a course on blankety blank. Uh, if you'll promote it for me, I'll give you 50% commission. It's got affiliate management all tracked in. So you get your own login. You can see your stats um, in real time of what you've sold. Are you up for it? You get someone that says, yes, great. So you've got zero cost marketing. You're on 50% of the revenue, which causes the digital product is all profit. So that's 50%. Uh, but also bear in mind that all of us started with no list. And this has also got tools in it for building landing pages. So you could come up with a freebie giveaway and then maybe do some social media posts on, you know, promoting your freebie giveaway, use the landing page to build a database and then using the rules, you could then follow up and market your product to people. So rather than just, you know, you, of course you could just go straight for the sale. You could promote on Facebook or YouTube or, or anywhere, quite frankly, hey, I've got this amazing course, check it out here and send people straight to your sales page. Or you could just give away a free resource to people to get the opt-in, probably easier to get the name and email address. Then you're building a database and you can have a follow-up email that goes to those people to promote the course or product that you have for sale. Uh, Kedian says, where can we find list owners? Uh, it's called the internet, Kedian. So basically, whatever niche you're in, you want to find... Um, you know, who are the companies that operate in that niche? So for example, I've got a business in the music industry. So we were to define who are the database owners in the music industry? Well, to start off with, didn't have a clue, but you just got to think about it and think, okay, music industry database. So what sort of products and services do people buy in the music industry? So one of the things we thought of wasn't hard was musical instruments people interested in the music industry probably buy musical instruments. So then we just searched for drum kits, keyboards, pianos, guitars on Google to find out who are the companies that rank on the first page of Google for those keyword phrases. Because guess what? They are probably the companies that sell the most keyboards, guitars, pianos, drums, i.e. have got the biggest database of musicians that have bought musical equipment, i.e. They are the perfect person to call and see if they want to do a JV. We also talk about what professional bodies might people in the market for music courses be a member of. And we came up with the Musicians Union and Basker. So we approached them and did JVs with them. So really the process is think about what products and services would your target audience buy and then go and look and see who are the biggest fish in that market. And another really good tip is go and buy a magazine that relates to that niche. So if there's a magazine for sale in WH Smiths on your topic, whether that's embroidery or fishing or uh, house restorations or whatever it is, if you go and buy the magazine in that niche and then look at the companies with the big adverts, the big half page, full page adverts, they are probably the biggest fish in that industry. They're probably the businesses with the biggest databases so that's a great way to approach. There is another route you can use, which is using what's called a list broker. And if you just go to Google, type in list brokers UK or list brokers wherever you are in the world, you'll find there are companies that act as this intermediary and, the, and they broker between somebody with a product or service and somebody with a database and a list that is willing to do promotions. So hopefully that gives you some clues on that. Uh, I think that's the same question from Peter. Uh, Michael says, are landing pages hosted within the software? Uh, yes, everything is hosted in the in the platform, Michael. So you don't need to buy hosting separately, which is another saving as well, isn't it? Because often you are, um, you know, you need some hosting where you're registering your domain names, etc. Um, so you don't need a hosting account. So there's another saving there. Uh, Mark says, would you replace Kajabi if you're an existing user, or would you just this is more for a startup? Great question, Mark. So I haven't even using it. Uh, as I say, for a day. And for anyone that's very established, so we're very established with Kajabi. Although Kajabi's costing me thousands per year, you have what's called in the industry the pain of disconnect. Okay. And the pain of disconnect is what would it cost me to move all of my courses and all of my users and all of my customers from Kajabi to this platform? Now, I've got 
45 courses on Kajabi. We've got several thousand members in Kajabi. So probably for me, the pain of disconnect is too big because the advantage is, yeah, even if I went to the Rolls Royce package on here, which is 97 a month. So my total bill would be a thousand dollars a year. And the technology stack I'd be sacking off probably is costing me five to ten thousand dollars a year. So I would probably be gaining, let's say nine thousand dollars a year by moving to this platform. But how many tens or hundreds of hours of manpower would it take to build my 45 courses in this platform and test it and migrate all the users and communicate to all the users? And still, how many users would still struggle to log into the new platform because it's a new URL or it's a new user ID and password? And how many of them will want a refund? And I think you can see it's it's not such an easy decision because my gut feel is given that you know we're quite a big business, turn over a few million pounds, that the pain of disconnect might be greater than the savings in my instance, because I'm very established. I've been using Kajabi for like eight, nine years. Now, if you've just started Kajabi and you've only got one or two courses on there and you've got tens or a couple of hundred users, I would think the answer probably is actually, I'd probably jump ship and move to this because it's a hell of a lot cheaper and does everything that you need all in one place. Okay. And if you're a startup, 100 million percent, I'll be starting with this. Okay. So hopefully that gives you some um, sort of candor to the answer there that if you're very established, 10 years with Kajabi, tens of courses, thousands of users, not sure I'd jump ship, but low end Kajabi user absolutely would jump ship, startup, million percent jump ship. So um, cool. Right. Uh, I think we're all just, done. Uh, yeah. So thank you everyone for um, showing up. Amazing feedback. I've just scrolled. It took me ages to go while Simon was talking. I was listening and watching and learning myself and scrolling through the chat and so much engagement. So really hope that you've uh, got great value from today. Like that was really insightful what Simon's just shared about that platform. Hopefully you got great value from what I shared. That offer stands literally as a gift, one off 47 pounds, it's not monthly, no recurring, literally because you're still here and you show up on a Saturday morning with Simon um, and the link is in the chat. So I'd be privileged to share with you. But from myself, I'll just say uh, thank you for being here today and good luck with your ventures. And I look forward to doing a session next month. Brilliant. Thank you, Ben. And uh, thank you, everyone, for showing up. Glad you uh, enjoyed today. And uh, I'm going to put my feet up. I've had my second COVID jab today. So I'll be waiting for the after effects to kick in this evening or probably feeling rough as. But right now, feeling good. Sun is shining. So enjoy the rest of your day. Cheers, Ben. <laughs> and uh, we'll catch you all very soon. Cheers and good night. Thank you.